This next technique is called a vignette. And a vignette is a nice simple way to add detail to the background without adding too much detail. So this is a great technique to use if you have a very detailed drawing um, or you already have some sort of texture or additional technique that you don't want to take away from. Um, it's very similar to framing, so this could definitely work as a rule of composition for framing your focal point where you're making the outside edges darker, fading into more of a lighter value around your focus or around the center of your still life. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and play the time lapse and I'm just using charcoal in the video here, uh, making the outside a lot darker and then pressing a lot lighter as I get closer to the inside. Um, now you could definitely use different materials for your vignette. So this could be done with watercolor paints um, or even just regular pencil, um, pastels. So think about the medium that you would like to use. Uh, but if you want to keep it consistent with charcoal, you can definitely use charcoal for this technique. So again, I'm just uh, kind of blending things in on the outside, fading it to a lighter value. If this sort of texture works well for your composition, you could leave it with this texture, um, but in the video I'm going in with a blending stump and I'm smoothing everything out to have a really smooth value change from dark on the outside to that lighter value in the middle. Um, so think about if you like the texture, if it works for leading line or if you maybe use hatching or cross hatching for your drawing, um, it would be a great way to incorporate that texture into your piece. Um, so here is the blended uh, vignette added into the background.